everybody, BrickLover18 here today with another episode of BrickLover18 Asks You. So last week on BrickLover18 Asks You, I said if LEGO CEO was fired and you became CEO, what would be the first thing that you would do to the LEGO company? I got so many responses this week, like way more than any other week, but here are my favorites. But before I read those, it was kind of funny because last week I used a clickbait to say Lego CEO was fired, and as you can see, five people really didn't like that. Ozzy Brick said the first thing he would do would be to re-release the monorail. Brendan Wong would open up more Lego stores as well as designing sets that are more unique and less fire and police sets. H2 Brick wouldn't really want to be the CEO. Cody Lego Dude, the first thing he would do would be to lower the price on Lego and then add some new themes like TV show themes. Kill Your Baby Doll says he would make more sets centered around city themed buildings. The creator, if I were CEO, I would make a stream of sets dedicated to people on YouTube. Nix Bricks would have more modular creator sets come out every year. Kubrick would make more sets for adults and re release the old 9 volt trains. Lego for Mitch would get rid of Chima and Ninjago. My question for you this week is what is your opinion on people that bring Lego mocks to conventions and their mock is not an original mock? I'm mainly asking this question for me because I really want to bring this JK Brickworks Lego safe to Philly Brickfest. He came up with the original concept but I kind of changed the outside design and I'm like, I, I'm out torn, like it's not my original mock, but I'd still like to bring it and show it off. So I just want to hear your thoughts down below. Should you do that or should your B-mocks be completely original and not ever done by anybody else? Thanks everybody for watching and please feel free to leave your comments down below. Thanks so much for watching this Brick Lover 18 LEGO video. If you enjoyed this video and you want to subscribe for all LEGO all the time, click the subscribe brick and you'll subscribe to our channel. If you want to see more of our previously uploaded LEGO YouTube videos, check the cards as there's a playlist there containing all our videos. If you want to see more Brick Lover 18, head on over to BrickLover18.com where you'll find the links to our Twitter and our Instagram and our Brick Plan. Before you go, don't forget to leave a like on this video as well as a comment. And don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already by clicking the subscribe brick. Thanks everybody for watching and I hope you have a great day.